Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of the Magnificent Opinions with Stevie. And today's episode is brought to you by Titanfall. I don't know why I said that. I, I was going somewhere with it, and then I just lost it and put Titanfall. Hey, uh, today's game of Titanfall, uh, we're playing a game of attrition. Uh, I get, uh, we win. Uh, I get 89 nutrition points, MVP, and best player in the game, you know, as a, as usual. I mean, when do I never get best player of the game? Uh, I got 16 pilot kills to 2 deaths. I don't care about minion kills, because they're only minions. I mean, you can get 3,800 minion kills and one titan pilot kill to 13 deaths. Uh, anyway, um, and today's topic is something that there's quite a big taboo on uh, nowadays. Uh, it's it's sex. Uh, this is this is probably the, f the first serious, or at least semi-serious, depends on your viewpoint on it. Uh, subject I've touched on in these series uh, out of th three videos, which you know I've, I've kind of been putting off the more serious subjects. Because ah, it's a new series, so I don't want people to be put off straight away. Uh, or, or more put off than they would be from just listening to my voice and talking on about things that I uh, I feel passionate or opposite of passionate about. And my opinions on the subject. Sex is... It, nowadays, it's people like... It's, no, no it's, people just don't want sex. Oh, I said, no, no, sorry, let me rephrase that. People want sex, but at the same time, they don't want sex. I mean, uh, like, the amount of pressure put, like, porn, like, it's, it's always been a, it's always been a thing for the last, I don't know how long, uh, really, at least the last hundred years, probably 200, I don't know when porn was first invented, um, like proper porn, like I don't mean like, like yeah, you know what I mean, like films and um, pictures, and what, whatever you what, like. It's it, it's been around for a while, and that kind of, and, and nowadays with internet porn, it it it, it pressures uh, the younger generation to have more sex, except. That the younger generation think that they don't want sex and that it's wrong to have sex at the same time. Like they want it, but if 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 you if you have it, you you're you're a slut or a player. Or something. You're you're labelled as this this person just because you have sex. I mean, sex is it's it's natural. It's there's nothing wrong with it. It's, I mean, sure, it's pleasurable, but people look at it as this, this is kind of dirty act, but all it is is, it's no different than playing on your phone in reality, except that playing on your phone doesn't further the human race. You know, it's self-preservation in action, literally. Um, and it's... It's the kind of thing. Uh, it's like young people, especially, have this this feeling on it. Like I say, young, I don't mean like kids. I mean like young, like early teens to kind of kind of my age, where inhibitions are high. No, not high. Uh, there, there are a lot of inhibitions. And at the same time, no inhibitions. Because you've got the people who are having sex constantly, and then the people who who, who think that, no, I, I, if I'm in a relationship, I shouldn't want sex. Or I shouldn't have sex. Or you shouldn't have sex with me. And it's... Well, it's, when you think about it, that's the only re reason to really be in a relationship. Which is, it's... Because relationships, they've got two outcomes. Either you break up, or you stay with each other forever and ever. 
and you get married and you have kids and grandkids maybe, possibly, if you're both fertile and you don't have any problems. And then you die together, holding hands, or maybe one dies before the other. Um, but yeah, that, that is one of the two outcomes, so you either have the sex and get on with it and have kids and then grandkids, or you have sex and you have fun and then you go, well, bye, or you just don't have sex and it's like, sure, sure okay, in relationships there's more than just having sex, but it's sex, sex has been hyped up in such a big thing that it's... It's, it's dirty, it's wrong. But then, it's good to have it. And people kind of need to get it into their, their heads that... Like, we need to stop getting the idea in people's heads that it's, it is this this thing that is, is bad and is looked down upon. Because, like... People go out and get wasted, and that's looked down upon less than going out and sleeping with pe as many people as you want. Like if if I went out to a bar and got absolutely hammered, I would be I would probably make more friends doing that than I would um, going out to a bar and sleeping with all the ladies there, or women, girls, teenagers, or well, not teenagers, that makes me sound kind of creepy, but people my age, yeah, because that's probably the only people I would get to sleep with me, really, honestly, um, but that, I would be frowned, oh, you're such a, oh, you're a player, oh no, don't like relationships, no, no, they set that label on you, but then, if you, go out, if you go out and you don't have sex, that's also found upon. And I mean, that's that's social hypocritism, and that's probably, that I'm fairly certain, hypocrisy, that's what, hypocritism. I just made a word up when it's already a word. But that's that's something I, I'm going to cover maybe in a later video. But social hypocrisy, it just comes into play here because it's either you have too much sex, or you have too little sex. You can't have just enough sex because we, we've kind of shepherded everyone into these two categories and they're both negative. We, we haven't... We, we, like You get all this negative reinforcement that is just... You, you shouldn't do it. And it's ridiculous because <laughs> there's there's nothing wrong with it in reality, and there's this massive taboo about it, and it's just kind of a little bit ridiculous. Especially it's I mean it's now 2015, and people still think that having sex is bad. Like seriously, like, seriously, it's 2015. It's time you opened your eyes. It's 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 not a big deal. Anyway, uh, that's been today's Opinions with Stevie. Don't forget, everything you need to know is, as always, in the description below. I've been Stevie. Peace.